Hello everybody, welcome back to Art Smart. Today I'd like to talk to you about Animal Farm. Now this particular version that I have here is from Digiview. This is a uh, public domain copy that you uh, used to be able to find in places like the Dollar Tree. But uh, there are tons of copies of this particular film out there, including on lots of public domain websites. So I'm talking more about the film itself today than this particular release. I just want you to be able to see it though. Uh, they have a pretty uh, it's it's an okay screen capture here, although the characters here in the front are clear and then it's kind of blurry back here. And that's just because of uh, how they grab this particular screenshot. Um, you also have some pictures back here and a quick little write-up, which is, I guess, kind of nice. And here, oh, it's upside down, but here's the DVD if you want to look at that. Now, Animal Farm, for those of you who haven't read it, is a uh, story about how basically a farm kind of overthrows the uh, mean farmer, and then you see how society is restructured, and how you see how corruption steps back in, and eventually the pigs basically become like the farmer. Um, this particular story is quite uh, popular uh, to be read in school systems, especially here in the United States, but really around the world. And uh, this particular version of the film was produced in the 1950s. This was produced uh, by a English uh, production company, and I think that this is actually one of the finest films that has been released outside of the United States. I really do. Uh, Bachelor and Ho I'm sorry, and Hollis were the uh, two main directors on this particular film, and they produced a lot of cartoons in England uh, throughout the 1950s and 60s. Uh, I think this is really uh, quite a masterpiece when you consider the fact that they had very little support in making this particular film. They did it on a relatively small budget, relatively, um, from the time, and they also are really working with a difficult subject. This is not a kid's movie by any means. This does not have uh, the classic Disney happy uh, joking character that you're used to. This does not have uh, the uh, star uh, original a character that you can kind of follow along on their journey, which is a typical thing for a lot of animated films. This is a film that uh, shows a community and how it uh, completely falls apart and then restructures itself and then falls apart again. So it's very difficult stuff. And so I, I think it's quite impressive what they are able to do here. It is not a hugely enjoyable watch because you don't really have somebody to identify and say, yes, this is a main character and I'm going to watch them grow. Uh, it's, it is not uh, something that is terribly uh, engaging in that kind of way, but you do get to see quite a bit of how this farm is restructured, and I think they capture the spirit of the book pretty well. Maybe not some of the nuances of it, and uh, some of the political things here are very, very subtle, while in the book it's a little bit more straightforward. But in general, I think they do a pretty good job of producing this particular film. They are able to produce characters, and I'll show you again some of the screenshots. Characters that look cartoony enough to be plausible to take care of themselves on this farm, but also realistic enough where you can see the actual animal behind it, which is a difficult trick to pull off in animation. A lot of times you see them go one way or the other, very cartoony or very much realistic. This one kind of walks a fine line in between and somehow they make it work. Now, please do not be a parent thinking that this is just a happy Disney film, that it's called Animal Far uh, Farm, and you pick this up and you just put it on for your kids without watching it with them. This is a film that is going to give them nightmares because the pigs turn out to be these uh, bad guys that kind of take back over the farm, and uh, it's actually quite scary to a degree when the pigs start standing up on their hind legs and acting as if they are now the masters. In, in reality, they have become the masters. Uh, it's pretty scary stuff for little kids. Uh, not exactly stuff that's going to make them scream, but I think that it's definitely going to resonate in their minds and probably give them nightmares. So definitely watch this with your kids if you're going to do that and wait until they're a little bit older. Uh, but in general, this is a fine, fine animated film. Uh, like I said, not uh, hugely exciting, not the most interesting because there's no uh, real main character, but it is well done and it de definitely does justice to the book. One thing that you should know is they have changed the ending a bit here. 
here where there is an animal revolt against the pigs. Uh, this is not done in the original story, but I think here it makes sense. It's just there is such tension in the film where if you don't see them have a second revolt against the pigs, and by the way, spoiler alert, you know, they, they rise up again for a second revolt. Sorry. Uh, but uh, in this particular film, I think it needs that kind of tension release. It's definitely a stressful film. And uh, without it, I think this would probably be a lot worse in giving more kids nightmares. So I understand why they added on an ed a ending here that you don't get in the original story. Uh, so I think that that's perfectly fine and still pretty much in keeping with the original. So anyway, when I pick this up, yes, especially if you can get one of these cheap versions, it's actually uh, a perfectly fine, clean-looking print. Uh, you don't need to spend a bunch of money on this. And it's a really good film that stands the test of time, and it stands up against Disney. It's one of the few films from the 50s and 60s and that kind of era that actually does stand up with the Disney features. Hopefully this makes you a little bit more art smart, and you'll come back for more cartoon reviews, movie reviews and DVD reviews. Thank you. Bye-bye.